Hey guys, it's Matthias from S. Matthias C. I'm an advertising photographer from Austria, Vienna. And I asked you guys if you would like to see how this image was created. And you have decided. So here I am and let's get right into it. First of all, I needed the right height for the car. On a normal set, I would recommend a ladder. But you have to take what you've got. And I've got this. <laughs> okay, back to work. Now I had the fitting height, I started with some panning shots at one tixth of a second. I used a polarized filter, set my ISO to 100 and my aperture to f11, since I needed the slow shutter speed for the blur at bright daylight. You could do this manually in Photoshop, but I find it kinda hard to mimic the exact feeling of real motion blur, for example on these wheels. It's a little challenge to get a nice panning shot. I needed some attempts. After sorting the pictures, I loaded them into Photoshop, stitched them together, masked everything so it blends well, and I added a little bit more blur for a better connection of the pictures. Now we have a base to edit. Starting off with some filters to get from day to night, I used brightness, color tone, curves, and a picture filter. Then we can draw in some car lights. For this, I typically use a very soft brush with a really low flow. So I have full control about every stroke I take. After the front light, I did the back light and finally some blue lights. I added a night sky and corrected the colors. Last but not least, some details. Now, Reduce everything so it blends in and boom! Round it off with a little color grade and that's it. That's how I created the life race at night.